Hi, I'm Dr. Peter Larkins. Australia has a fantastic tradition in sport, but unfortunately sports injuries are part of the scene. The thumb region can be injured any number of ways in sport, but often involves an awkward tackle or falling on an outstretched arm. The injury often involves the ulnar collateral ligament of the thumb joint, and taping has been shown to provide control and stability to return to sport. Physio Nick Ames will demonstrate a thumb taping technique which will provide control, support and allow an earlier return to activity. What I start with is a 38mm reach of tape as an anchor, just round the wrist, just put it lightly around there, not a lot of tension on this, just so there's no circulation cut off, but just forms a good anchor for the tape. I next take the 25mm elasto rigid tape and I'm using this as some guy ropes really to hold the, the thumb, give it a bit more um, uh, support, a bit more bulk to the tape. Because we're trying to stop the thumb going out this way, the pull of the tape is pulling the thumb back this way to a degree. So I start on the inside and just take the tape around the back of Carla's hand. Next bit of tape we come all down the middle, making sure I don't go over that interphalangeal joint, the joint of the thumb, so that they can still be bent. And lastly, one for the inside, across back to here. Now I use the 25mm elasto wrap stretch, again round that the base of the thumb, not much pressure around there, but we're trying to support this way, so the pull of the tape is going back towards the back of the hand, down through here, wrap it around the wrist once, and then come back behind the thumb, round the thumb again, pulling a bit of tension through there to tighten it up, back round through here, and one more pass, round through the front of the thumb, and there, wrap one more time round, and lock it off with the 25 more rigid. So therefore that gives that thumb some good support, stops it being pulled too far to the side, so it protects Kayla's ligaments when she goes back and plays netball. The elbow is a strong joint, but it can still be injured, such as in an awkward tackle in football or falling on an outstretched arm. Often the injury is to the medial capsule or medial ligament, and strapping has been shown to provide protection, stability, and allow people to return to activity. Physio Nick Ames will demonstrate a taping technique that provides control, good support, but still allows mobility so people can return to activity as soon as it's safe to do so. The idea of the tape is to restrict the movement to a degree, so you're trying to prevent hyperextension and prevent this lateral or um, valgus force on the, on the um, elbow. So I'm going to get Ben to hold his elbow in about 40 degrees of flexion first of all. I start using um, some elasto wrap which just protects um, his cubital fossa which is a fairly sensitive part of the, the skin. Put some anchors each end using the 38mm rigid tape. Being careful, because uh, it's round the forearm, I don't want to have too much pressure here to stop the circulation, so I just get Ben to tense up a little bit, so he tenses his muscles. So we don't cut off the circulation by putting rigid tape all the way around the limb. And same thing at the top.
right, right round. No tension, just laying it on, just to form a base for the tape to attach to. Now again, using a 38mm rigid tape, I'm going to form some cruciate or cross strapping around the front of the elbow, which is going to help prevent it hyperextending to start with. So we start here across the elbow. And because this medial ligament is the one that gets damaged most, I'm going to put some more tape across that medial joint line. So coming down through here. And then from the other side, coming back. Right, let's lock that off with the rigid again. I'll finish it off using the Elastorap stretch, which you can just round. Again, round through. Just leaving the back of the elbow free, making sure the tape covers that particular medial part of the elbow joint. And you see now that Ben is restricted in extension, so he can't go fully extended. So it protects that, that front of the elbow joint and the side. These demonstrations have shown how the Elastoplast resilient range of taping products allows a return to activity after injury to a range of joints in the body. For more information, contact Elastoplast or visit Elastoplast online at elastoplast.com.au.